in eternity past, when the Father gave you to the Son as a love gift, Jesus loved you. When Jesus agreed in the eternal counsels of the Trinity to come to earth to accomplish your redemption, to lay down his life on your behalf, he loved you. When through the miraculous work of the Holy Spirit, he entered the womb of the Virgin Mary, when the eternal God became man, he loved you. When he grew up as a, as a an infant, a child, and then worked in the family business, then took it over in those 30 silent years when he was earning the righteousness that he would one day give you as a gift. You were on his heart and mind. He loved you. On the day that he entered his ministry, and each day through those three and a half years as he taught, as he revealed the Father, he knew that he was doing so not only for those who heard him in person, but for those who would read from the apostles' writings those words as well. He was thinking of you. His heart was on you. In the Garden of Gethsemane, he knew those for whom he would offer himself. You were on his heart. Through those six hours on the cross, he loved you. On the day that you were born, during the years you lived in rebellion against him, and on the day that he redeemed you and brought you to himself, he loved you. On the day of your greatest joy and on the day of your deepest and most profound sorrow, And on the day of your darkest and most heinous sin, he loves you.